So Robe's a great season so far and how special would it be to top it off with that grand final ring come Saturday? Yeah, well hopefully, you know, like you say, you're right, um, it'd be amazing, do you know what I mean, the, the way to, to finish the season. I think we've been, first year we've been very consistent, the best team all year, um, but I suppose it's sometimes cruel's pretty sporting, and pretty, it's pretty cruel, sorry. And we got a reminder of that at, at Wembley, so um, hopefully we've learned from them lessons and um, yeah, we can take that into account this week, but you know, what, a, what a great week it is for us to be involved in and, and um, yeah, we're all giving up for Saturday night. And just as captain, how special would it be for you to, to walk down that tunnel and lead the boys out at such an iconic stadium? Yeah, it'd be a, you know, such a proud moment, I think. I've been very lucky thinking back to, to playing Grand Finals before and I know what it's like to win and, and to lose here. So, um, yeah, but like I say, to walk out as captain, um, you know, it would be amazing. And, you know, I, I almost don't want to think about it too much because you know, any time you walk out of that tunnel, you know what I mean, you cannot buy that feeling. Um, but yeah, to do it as captain will be a special moment, uh, but one that I'm looking forward to and I'm really embracing and I'm really glad that the team we've got that we're, we're going onto the field with um, is fantastic, yeah. And we, we now know it'll be Salford we face in the final. What are your thoughts on, on that as a, as, a, as a story for rugby league on the whole? Yeah, great storyline. I suppose a lot has been made of, about the kind of success story of Salford, the way they've, they've kind of climbed up the table. Um, you know, they've obviously got the Man of Steel, they're, they're doing really well, they've found a grand, a grand final, they've, they've been out the line like, for a number of years. And, um, yeah, everything that goes with it, they're going well on off the field by, by all accounts. So, yeah, great storyline for the sport, but I suppose our job is to put that to one side and, and uh, you know, do what we do best on a rugby field on, on Saturday night. And they've got a lot of threats, you know. Everyone's talking about Jackson Ace being Man of Steel, but, you know, Chris Union, you've got nine levels at the back as well. They've got threats all over the field, haven't they? Yeah, definitely. Uh, like I said, Jackson Hastings, you know, uh, Man of Steel, he's, he's got a lot of attributes to his game. He's uh, created a lot of opportunities. He's probably been a key part of, of Salford's success story this year. Um, but then, you know, they've got other you know, key men. They've got obviously ex saints like Josh Jones, Matt Flanagan. They know what it takes to win grand finals. Gil Dudson here today, Lee Mossett, the big lads, you know what I mean? They're going to take some stopping. They've got a lot of speed in their outside back. So, yeah, they're, they're a well-organised team, you know, and obviously, like we've seen, uh, last week against Wigan, they performed on the biggest stage and that was a real test for my thought and they showed up with it and obviously got the win in, in, in fantastic form so uh, we won't be taking them lightly, you know what I mean, we know what they're capable of. And you, you know, you've, you've won grand finals in the past but you think as captain, if we can lift that trophy on the back of what a great season it's been, breaking records in the league, do you think it'll be up there with the pinnacle of your career? Definitely, yeah, I think... Uh, like you say, to get to do it as captain and with this group of blokes and staff and the journey we've been on I suppose over the last couple of years or so um, there'd be no you know no more fitting way to, to kind of send Justin home to. So yeah it'd be fantastic, do you know what I mean? It's uh, like I say I'm almost excited by the prospect of it but don't want to get too tangled at the moment.